Good morning, unicorns. Time for KWSC News. I'm Emily. And I'm Ben. And today, today is Tuesday, Tuesday November 29th, 2022. 2022. It's the 62nd day of school. Let's stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. At WSE, we reach for the stars. We are safe, respectful, and responsible. And now some words of wisdom from Principal Bailey. Good morning. I came to school early this morning to get some work done. And it made me think about procrastination. Remember we talked about that? Do you remember what procrastination is? Procrastination is whenever you put off doing something now and thinking I'll do it later when it comes to mind. Well, I want to share a little rule with you that, that I have. I don't talk to people about it. It's just something that kind of goes on in my head. The rule I made for myself, I think of it as the one minute rule. So if something comes to my head that I need to do, sometimes I ask myself, can I get this done in less than a minute? And if it's something that I could do in less than a minute, I just do it right then. I tell myself, one minute rule, get it done. So let me give you an example. Let's say in the morning you get up and you're getting ready for school and you look down at your bed and the, the thought crosses your mind. I could make my bed. Nah. Or maybe before bed, you know you should brush your teeth and you think, oh, I need to brush my teeth. Nah, I'll do it in the morning. Or maybe you see your clothes on the floor and you think, uh, ooh, I could pick those up. Nah, do it later. Or maybe when you take your clothes off, you throw them on the floor instead of putting them where they belong. All those little things take less than a minute. You could do all those things in less than a minute. After dinner, you could pick up your dishes and scrape them in the trash, and put them in the sink or the dishwasher. You could do that in less than a minute. So those little things that come to mind that are less than a minute, just do them right then. Don't be a procrastinator. You know what you'll find? All those little less than a minute things, they really add up. So if you don't do those things that need to be done in less than a minute, I'd say come Saturday, mom's going to be saying, hey, you got to take care of your stuff. You got to clean your room. You got to pick up your things. You got to do whatever with your clothes. If you had done those little less than a minute rules all week, you won't have much to do. But if you didn't, it may take you a few hours to get all your work done. It piles up pretty quick. So try living by my little one minute rule. Keep it in your head. If I can do it in one minute, I'll just do it now. And there's some words of wisdom. I hope you have a great day. Or not, the choice is yours. It's time for our words of the week. This week, our wow words have opposite meanings. That means they're antonyms. To enlighten means to instruct or explain. To baffle means to confuse someone. If you are enlightened, you have understanding about something. If you are baffled, you are just plain confused and perplexed. Don't forget, you can subscribe to Walnut Springs Announcements on YouTube. This is Kimber. Emily and Mackenzie. Here are the lunch choices for tomorrow. Wednesday, choice one, chicken nuggets with a dinner roll. Choice two, grilled three cheese sandwich. Choice three, turkey ham and cheese sandwich. Now back to the, the studio. studio. Hi, this is Eleanor with your birthday for November 29th. We have no birthdays to celebrate today. Bummer. And now for the daily joke. What do Santa's elves drive? I don't know. What do Santa's elves drive? Minivans. Get it? <laughs> I so get it. 
Here's what's happening. Tuesday, there will be a grade level spelling bee on Friday. I love spelling bees. Can you spell excited? Excited. E-X-C-I-T-E-D. Excited. Good job. Good luck, everyone, on Friday. The winners of the grade level spelling bees will then compete against each other. Let's see. Today's weather will be... Here's your weather for Tuesday. The high for today is 78 and the low for today is 45. It's going to be partly cloudy. Stay tuned for Book Talk Tuesday. And have an awesome day, unicorns. Be safe, respectful, and responsible. See you next time. Hi, Miss Galicchio here. It's Book Talk Tuesday. Now, I'm showing you these books because these are just some of the Christmas books and holiday books that we have in our library. And remember, you can tell it's a holiday book because it's got this awesome candy cane sticker on the spine. So, if you're looking for a holiday book, be sure to check out the ones that are on display in the library and they have that candy cane holiday sticker. And here's a couple of examples. This is Llama Llama Holiday Drama <laughs> and Olivia and the Christmas Present. Please turn off this presentation. Please turn off this presentation. Have a great day.